And my name is Osman. I become from Syria. There's a city. I live in the jungle in the camp. Random tents in everywhere. You can't even imagine it. It's miserable. There's no electricity at all. It's completely dark. I have to just walk, it's like one kilometer to go down to the toilet. There's many people advise me, don't waste your time all the time in the camp, go to the school, and I just ask them what kind of a school. They, they lead me, it's like to the Samus Volunteer Alpha Center. There's many people feeling cold in the camp and they, they come and running out from the winter, from the weather. They come to Afa because we serve the people with a cup of tea, they charge in their phone, they take some lessons in the classes. They feel good and happy. First time that I went to Alpha, I was with a, a friend. We just went for some cup of tea. And I saw that they were giving some classes, great class, English classes. And I decided to, to improve my English and to learn Greek. Before it, I, I couldn't imagine me teaching. I didn't like it, so I was really, really afraid, but now I like it, I, it's, it's exciting, it's interesting, seeing that people didn't know any, anything, and now they know it. If you, they give you one day to live in the camp, you will see what exactly are most volunteers and especially Alpha gives to refugees. So if you have some place like Alpha to go to drink some tea, you have the chance to learn something and your clothes very dirty, washed in the laundry, it's very 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 good, very good. Besides the Alpha Center, we also run a laundry station where we wash more than 70 bags a day. And we run for 12 hours a day, six days a week for all of the weeks of the year. And we are also the only laundry station running in Samos Town, and so the only laundry station people have access to. When we hand out bags at the end of the day and we give people their washed baby clothes and their washed blankets, we a lot of times see people having a very grateful and thankful look in their eyes. It is never enough and we are very aware that we always want to work more and we want to have a bigger station and we want to reach more people and wash everyone clothes in the camp. People are very grateful that we do the, the work we do. Dreams have crossed uncertain waters Trying to find some solid ground But when the world is growing darker A ray of hope can still be found In the company of strangers On a shore of sifting sand Holding on to hope and sounds Reaching out an upturned hand Gonna fill my life with living Try to love a little more each day Holding on to hope and sounds Hope and hope won't slip away